What's going on, y'all? Welcome to episode 29. I almost said 9. That would have been wrong. Episode 29. Uh, we are about to play the second leg of the Juventus Man City match. We're playing the home home leg. Um, we are, let's see where we're at. We are in March of 2026. The UEFA Champions League. I think we're still in second place in the Premier League. We're in 95 overall. we got to be like the best player in the world. Uh, our stats don't show it yet, though. I think that we're at 20 goals Good evening, and welcome in the Premier so League. About going into tonight's we'll have to check out some of that stuff here in just a minute. I'm, Derek Ray, and my partner, I'm eager to continue the good form that we had against Juventus. I thought it would be a great place for us to start this episode because of the good result that we were having. Oh, we got to get in front of this guy. Oh, we could not do so. I think this could be tight. Well, the fans really want him to there we go. Get a oh man, that guy's gonna give us a problem. Man bun in the back. What I'm gonna call him? Oh, we were about to rip one. It's deflected. Already can tell this is just a, a, a completely different feel to this game than the first couple of the last episode. So I think it's only going to go up from here. Very nice. I don't think we got credit for stealing that. In fact, I think if anything, we stole it from our teammate. Vargas! <laughs> no. So close. Man. Absolutely ripped that pep. Unhappy. Wishing that blade of grass was our face so that we could feel it. Feel the pain. Put him on the prayer list at church. He's got bad thoughts running through his mind right now. Oh, a little skill move. That's my skill move for the episode. Or at least for the game. Patient build up at the moment. Well, they couldn't keep that sequence going, unfortunately. Oh, we have tons of space. But so does Holland. Holland on goal. And he's going to slot it in the back of the net. I love playing with Holland because if you need an assist. And you see him making a run. As long as you get the ball to him, he's probably going to bury it. And he does so right there. Number seven and number nine. Linking up. The, the, the American and the Norwegian. I'm not mistaken. The Viking. He looks like a Viking, man. A really nice dude, though. From what I've seen. Seems like he's a class act. Sometimes people get things in life and they deserve it. And you just can't help but love them, even when they're crushing your team. And I'm pretty sure if he played Charlotte FC, he would crush them. Not that I don't believe in my boys. But just a whole different thing. Play me back. There you are, Holland. Get through there. Go! We got two assists on the game, and that is a beauty. That is an absolute beauty. Holland had to work for that one a little bit. It was deflected. We played it off to the left. He had to, he had to work his way around number 15 there. And uh, find his way to the ball, I think. The goal in the 25th and the 37th there makes the aggregate score three to nothing. I think that's going to do it for this. Um for this stage of the Champions League. And Holland, he's like, man, I'm going to get you your hat trick of assist. I'm just, actually, I'm sure he was thinking about his own hat trick, but I'm sure he cares about us a little bit, you know. Can we get ourselves a goal? No, we cannot. Just deflect it off the defender's face. Mr. Bat Man Bun back there. I, I don't I need to catch his name here in a minute. Owen oh, Holland looking for his third. We could have held it up for a minute. We were making a good run. We just 
caught on to the move a little late. Vargas is going to rip one, but it is not the best idea, and it's not the best outcome. So, Holland, 37th minute and the 25th minute, and uh, Vargas so far the man to do that. Vargas trying to show us some cleavage there, but not working for you, bud. So the Champions League, round of 16, second leg, the well, second half is underway. Trying to think how old were I, what, what, will I be in 2026. I'm not sure if I am, am having trouble with the math or if I just don't want to do the math. So I, you know, I don't want to think about it. That would be three years from now, so I guess I'd be 31. It's really like our first time properly on defense in this match, which is a great feeling when you don't have to do it too often. Can we play our man through? Foden looks like he's going to be on goal. Just take the shot. Oh my gosh. You're playing like we did last episode, Foden. Can we put one in the back of the net? We finally get a goal after this. In oh my gosh. If, if you were watching last episode, you know how much I struggled. <laughs> you know that we really struggled to get back into form. And I told you that I, at the end of that episode that I was going to come out firing in the next episode. And I was going to record it right then so that I'd stay all the work that I had done to get back into form. Because it's been a minute since I played. Um, to get back into form, I wasn't going to let it go to waste. I was going to get right back into it. And it's really paying off. And it feels so good. It feels so good to you know, push and grind through a few episodes. And how we're up four to nothing on aggregate and three to nothing in this match in this ninety minutes. I wonder who that fast little guy is. Sixteen. I have to look that up. We did go through a transfer window that I that I did not take a look at. Oh, Vargas trying to get another one there. Probably should have played it back across to Holland. He was at the back post. And he's a pretty big target. For really any kind of ball. You can play it to him. He's fast enough. He can play. He, he, he can run onto a ball on the ground. He's big enough. He can wrestle his way. To a ball in the air. And Obed Vargas just having a wonderful game. Holland coming off. Maybe possibly giving us an opportunity to... Uh, to steal man of the match, I would think he would have it at this point. Edwards. Plenty of support here. Is this the moment? Here it is. Goal! Obed Vargas. Two goals. Two assists. Run into the corner flag. Celebrating with his teammates. Edwards. Edwards. That's who... Uh, number 16, the fast little guy, as I said. Um, probably not little at all. Probably towering over me in real life. But he was running next to Holland. Okay, so. <laughs> oh my gosh, Obed Vargas is on once again. Can he put this one in the goal? No, he cannot. Oh, the goalkeeper. I just, I mean, I would like to credit him for the save, but we were, just shot it right at him. So, you know, that was us, Keep. You can tag us on Twitter. Thank you for that one, Vargas. Signed, Keeper. And thank you to our Keeper for keeping the clean sheet. I would love to have a clean sheet in aggregate at the end of this round of 16. Oh, number 32, you got to clear that ball. Don't let it go out for a, another corner. That being said, Vargas sitting on a 9.3 rating. I love that. Oh, good steal from Vargas. Oh, we give it away again. Does bump us up to a 9.4 rating, though, so I'm not too upset about it. Spot on with that tackle. 
We are just plum tired. Oh, what was that? I'm going to blame that on being tired. Obed Vargas, easily, easily the man of that match. Five, who is that? <laughs> is, this some random, is that like the governor or something? Do they have governors in England? No. 9.7. 9.7 rating, two goals, two assists, shot accuracy 50%, passes 10. It's like six more than we had in one of those games last last episode. 90% pass, pass accuracy. Definitely one of my higher marks. And one that we should easily get to every game, honestly. Um, nice. 92 minutes played. We did a good job. That was a great game. Now let's carry that over. I was actually planning. Uh, I checked out the calendar before we started. I was planning on maybe playing. I think we should play this cup match because we're getting close. It's, it's we're getting close to the final, and then I want to come play Liverpool. But then that leaves us like one month. But I think that we're going to end up with some UCL matches in here. Plenty of UCL matches in here. So I'm going to keep it sparse. Let's take a quick look at this game. Let's sim to it over here. It's the quarterfinal. Uh, I think we'll sim it. Let's sim this thing. Right after we sim training. Looks like a sim machine. I think we're playing Sims, but we're not. I do want to do do this one the slow way. I want to check it out. I want to see what happens. Two to one, Vargas scoring the game winner in the 80th minute. I love that. I absolutely love that. That's awesome. All right, so I did say in the last episode, or I'm sorry, in the last game, that we would check out the player stats and see where we stand on goals in the Premier League. Vargas 7th with 15 goals. How about assists? Vargas 1st with 13 assists. And honestly, I think if we played more matches that we would 100% rocket up that ch rocket up that chart. So I want to make a quick statement about winning the stage of the tournament. Praise the team spirit. Definitely wasn't me. It was the team. We've seen what it looks like when I try to take control and be the only one doing anything. It doesn't work out, folks. It does not work out. All right, we do have some international games coming up. Man, I don't think this is anything important. I mean, if they're pulling Ferreira up, I don't think it's that important. But we're going to sim Watford here. Vargas scores again. 2-1 to one. Holland and Vargas. Ratings. Uh, yeah, Vargas with a 9.4. Absolutely phenomenal form right now. Now I would be so surprised if the US men's national team doesn't doesn't have us anywhere other than a sub. What is I don't understand. FIFA, you gotta fix this like thing where we have to pull up our uh training like this. This is crazy. Like, one of my only complaints about the game, other than all those other complaints that I always make about the game. USA versus Finland. Pulisic, Wea, Ferreira, Aronson. Ferreira's an 83 overall. Busio. Man, our back line sucks. Can't, is Zimmerman still playing in 2027? That's not real. 
all we're playing is Mexico. So we are going to sim this three to nothing. Timothy Wea, Timothy Wea, and Busio. Ratings Vargas with a seven point five. I'll take it. Not great, not bad. Keeps us in the starting lineup. I'm not sure who our coach was there, but he looked really mean, very mean. In fact, I think I'm just going to go ahead and sim this as well. Very similar team. Uh, Richards and Carter Vickers in the back. I like that a whole lot better than Vargas with the lone goal. Vargas with the winning goal, one to nothing against Mexico. Araujo came out in the 50th, and Pulisic came out in the 61st. Cannon on for Scavley late in the game, but Vargas with the winning goal in that one. I think Coach would be regretting not playing me more often. My God, we're about to have to. I, I, I think we're about to play Tottenham Hotspur in the UCL. So here's what I want to do. Here's what I think we're going to do. We, we, we need to fit two more matches in here. I want to play. I'm going to send this first Tottenham Hotspur match. We beat Aston Villa. Yep, and then we beat Tottenham Hotspur. And I'm going to go ahead and send the second Tottenham Hotspur match because it is at home. But first, I'm going to get some training in. I only have one more day to do it. Awesome. We're like the, the absolutely the star of the team at this point. Uh, and now we're going to head on over. We're going to come back over here and we're going to sim the second leg. We beat Hull City, then we beat Tottenham Hotspur again, and we're going to go play against Liverpool. I want to just crush Liverpool. For a straight A trainer. I was not a straight A student. Hop in the comments. We got a bunch of smart people on here. You guys like all geniuses? We got y'all all like straight A students or something? Or, or what? Because I definitely was not. I know you're not asking, but... Did we lose that? I think we might have lost that. Manchester City is in second place to the Spurs right now. This is a crucial match for us. Because we don't have much time left in this season. Only a couple of months. In fact, it may be a month after this game. Take a quick look. Yeah, we are down to just a couple of months. We have April and then the rest of May to go. A couple days in April, like nine days in April, and then May, and then that's it. And we have the UCL, the FA Cup, the Caribou Cup, Carabao, whatever, and the rest of the Premier League to go. We're in every single competition. We're looking for the treble. We're looking for the quadruple, I guess, if you include the Carabao Cup. <laughs> so we are looking to dominate, looking to win every trophy you can win, and then we're looking to repeat. Yes, thanks as always. Oh, what a slick little move. Nice pass. Great run. Oh my gosh, just a little bit too big of a touch. That's a great little one-two there. We're the man for this job. Plays forward. We've done the whole right wing thing. You can... Did we go Foden? Oh, and Holland. We got a hockey assist off of that. We'll take it. Holland slots it in the back of the net. Definitely contribute to that plenty enough. And uh, just as we should in those situations. One to nothing. Man City over Liverpool. Early in this one, 13th minute. Beautiful, absolutely beautiful. Oh, 
Get back up. Get up. Get up, Argus. Okay, we'll take the foul. Play it to you, boy. Play me in. Holland with the assist. No. Oh, Ben Vargas. Oh, so wide. No, not as wide as I thought, but that should have been in the back of the net every day of the week. Doesn't matter when you're as good as we are. That's got to be in the back of the net every time. Holland put that thing up on a platter for us, and we weren't able to convert. Obed Vargas once again with a wonderful pass from a teammate. Oh my, I, I, I didn't see. I knew I was making that run, but I thought maybe they were playing it to Holland, and then he turned around and left it, and it came right to me. It was a perfect pass. Perfect pass. Wow. Wow, 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 wow. And with that, the attack fizzles out. This might be ideal for Nice. The There's a skill move that... Oh, no. We should start doing uh, the, the thing I do with skill moves, where if I use one and it doesn't go very well, then I can't use another one for the rest of the episode. We should do the same thing with the spread button. Whereas if I use it on offense, moving forward, only when moving forward, because it wouldn't make sense to do that tracking back. But when if I use it and I take too big of a touch, then I can't use the sprint button moving forward, going forward for the rest of the game or episode, just depending on how you want to do it. I don't like that rule. I don't like putting rules like that on myself. And thankfully, the goalie comes out puts pressure on the Liverpool man, McAllister. It called, just causes him to disrupt a shot there. Nice turn. We have a man. Oh, you got to keep your run going there. I think that was Pedri. He's got to keep that run going. If he just commits to his run, the ball slips through to his feet. He's one on one with a goalie. And I got an assist. Here we go. Holland, I owe you an assist from a little bit earlier today. Now I'm going to put it to the right side of the goalie, and it's a goal. It is a goal. It's a wonderful goal from Obed Vargas. Put your arms out and celebrate, my friend. Guy behind you is just pumping the air. Point toward the fan. Tell him what it is. Tell him what it is. Obed Vargas from celebrating there. Holland gets the assist, I do believe. And uh, almost the same situation as the first time. Only this time it's it's not wide right. It's just tucked exactly where it needs to be. Two to nothing, Vargas. That was the very last thing that was going to happen in the half. 45th minute goal from Obed Vargas. We're going to have to move pretty quick uh, when it comes to this next game. Let's real quick, let's look at the objectives. The team possession rate is 65%. Five interceptions. I might get my interceptions, but we might could bump our team possession rate up. Let's just see. I mean, I, I, I want to get some... I want to chase some records. the problem. see what they can do here but I would like to see if we could actually get that objective I don't think I've done that on this channel yet where pass around or do anything specifically for a objective mostly because it's kind of boring sometimes what are we playing Middlesbrough for in the Premier League right now in the center. Mo Salah. And a Gakpo. McAllister sliding in. Our keeper able to handle that well, though. And then he handles it well to play it to me. We're going to play it over the top for Holland. Can Holland? Oh, my gosh. What a great defensive stand there. Play it forward. Oh, we got it exactly where we wanted it. Obed Vargas trying to just rip one when he really should have played it on the ground to uh, one of his teammates there. Probably a better opportunity for somebody else. 
than it was for, for yeah, Vargas, but you know, sometimes we are dull sided. And look at that, we had an opportunity there for ourselves. It was a good one, in, in fact. And they tried to find us back inside. Edwards, I believe, that was trying to play us back inside. And coach is yelling at us transition to position, transition to position. In other words, 2 0 is the most dangerous score in soccer. And uh, we're about to find out why, I think. Luckily, we did not have to suffer there. Oh, Foden. I don't know why he was trying to play it back inside when I was wide open, absolutely wide open. And Mo Salah almost creates a bad situation there for us. Thank God, thank the soccer gods that uh, that did not transpire. So far, a really great episode for Obed Vargas. We needed one. We had a, a just absolute downer. Get back up, keep. The last episode was just an absolute downer. And a quick reminder, we have FA Cup semi-final. Oh my gosh. Mm. That was a great opportunity to get to that 3 to nothing mark. What are you doing? Oh my gosh, I know what happened. Like right there, I called for the keep to come out but he didn't like right as I saw that ball being played through I didn't I didn't realize our, our number three was sitting right there and so whenever number three went in for the ball he thought I was calling for the pass and he started to try to make the pass and it was not a good time to call for a pass so he got absolutely just pummeled you know well yeah you do because you saw it you just News coming through like, a few game. seconds ago, saw it. Oh, Holland. And then there was nothing the goalkeeper could do at that point. He can only expect him to make so many one-on-one -on -one saves like that in the game. And he's already made a, a, a plethora of them today. And just like that, 2-1. to one, I will take the 2-1. to one. Holland in the 13th, Vargas in the 45th. Absolutely fair enough. I bet Fargus just a 7.6 rating, even though we had a hockey assist. I don't know why it doesn't uh, reward us for that, but it looks like everybody else kind of had a rough game too, except for Erling Holland, who had a goal and an assist. Manchester United beat Fulham 3 to nothing. That's good to see. So if we play Fulham, we know we're going to crush them. Yeah. Millsboro in the semifinals of the FA Cup. I think I want to play the final of the FA Cup. I don't want to. Oh, Manchester United. We're playing Manchester United in the UCL. I don't know what to. I almost want to do this. And that's what I'm going to do. Three to one. I want to come down here. I think and play the home match. That will just be the very last match of this episode. And I'm gonna go hang out with my wife. Manchester United at home. We are up three to one on aggregate. I believe this is the semifinals of the Champions League, the biggest sporting event, annual sporting event in the world. I love seeing like all the football people. I, I love football like as much as anybody. I love seeing like. The football people say before the Super Bowl, oh, the biggest sporting event in all the world, and all this stuff. And then, or even like baseball or basketball, they, they pump up the stats or whatever, but none of them have anything on the Champions League final. Now, we're not playing the Champions League final right now, this is the semifinal. 
but this will get us our golden ticket to said match. Oh, Herlin Holland with an early opportunity there. Obed Vargas. From distance, and it's completely blocked, but it is going to earn a corner, and Coach seems happy. He said it was a great run, so... Uh, while I think he would, like if I was a coach, I'd probably be very angry. Our coach was okay with it. Oh, I did not mean to take a shot there. I was trying to pass that, but whatever. Not much defensive cover there on the flank. Man, you know, you know, really. A tie here is not a bad thing. I really want to have a big impact on this game. Three to one. I want to see that like end up six to one or something, you know. But a couple of, of assists and a goal. That's my perfect game. Oh, we just made a big mistake. Or did we? Oh my gosh, and we almost put that one in the back of the net. I don't know why I passed that first opportunity. I mean, I was just wide open on goal. And, and, and I, I was just looking for some, before the ball even got to me, I was looking for somebody to pass it to. I don't know why I did that. Nice. Oh, could we get Erlen Holland into space there? Vargas. Oh my gosh, the keeper's able to beat him to it. But Vargas, if he could have gotten, a, if the keeper wasn't there, if the keeper wasn't there at all, and could have gotten a little bit of a head on it, I think that it would have gone in the back of the net. It'd have been a great opportunity, at least, to test the goalkeeper. That's really what we need to do. We've we've bounced it off the uh, the defense a few times. We've made it difficult, but we have not really tested the goalkeeper in this leg. The Champions League final. If we win this, folks, we are going to the biggest annual sporting event. They're going to make it hard. They're going to make it hard. Luckily, I think we, if, 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 if they tie us up, if they beat us 2 nothing in this version, or, or, or in this leg, we do have three away goals, which is crucial. Absolutely crucial. So I think we'd win on away goals, but... Oh my gosh, that was that was an odd touch. Nice, get it back. Ah, rough slide, bad slide. Coach wanted to let me know as well. Oh, we've been playing really direct, like not route one, but kind of just like back to the form of the beginning of last episode. So I've talked about a lot because it was just that bad. I don't know if you guys agree with that or not. I'd really rather you not tell me. <laughs> TBH. Nice. Erlen Holland. Oh, I wanted to send our guy number four there in. Great, great steal. Exactly what we needed in the moment. Kind of crowding things up right now, aren't I? Oof, bad pass from us. Right now, if we hold Man United to one to nothing, we do advance, but. Not with much pride, having lost at home. I don't know how that bodes for us. Maybe we can make it up. 
here. One on one with the goalkeeper. Oh my god, Obed Vargas puts it wide. Obed Vargas puts it wide at home. Marcus Edwards is coming off. Dembele is coming on. Look like for Man United. For Anthony. How, how, how do we miss that? One on one with the goalkeeper. That's a couple that we've just messed up. And thankfully, our goalkeeper's on top of it and doing his job. And he might be the only one on our team right now really performing. That was a good push in the back. Number eight there for man. Chester United. Phillips. A change in the offing for City. Oh, what a wonderful little touch. Oh, and we almost put another one. Oh, my gosh. But at least that time it was on frame, and it really challenged our goalkeeper, uh, the goalkeeper. These really tense moments here. Oh, another a volley. A half volley. Wonderful little chip there from our teammate to set that up and then deflection to make that really, really hard on the goalkeeper. But he's able to, uh, for the most part, stay in line with that one and uh, make the save. Oh, and Obed Vargas once again with an opportunity, but it's just way over. That one was headed to the training grounds the entire time. Mubel. Goalkeeper for Manchester United plays, puts the ball in play. Oh, and Obed Vargas sees the big touch, is patient, approaches, and makes the tackle, putting the ball out of bounds, slowing down Manchester United's attack, most importantly. And now we've got the ball back. Vargas screaming for it. It's a promising city move. Vargas from distance. Oh, and it's going to go in the goal. It's in. Vargas makes sure that this one's coming home to M -M 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 Manchester City. Oh, my gosh. What a rip. That wasn't deflected at all. That was just an absolute rip across the body of the fender. Through his legs, it was a nutmeg off the bottom of the top crossbar, which is the crossbar is the top bar. So, at... It's redundant. Obed Vargas in the 81st minute with a m glorious moment. Absolutely, absolutely important. Wow. Man, that, see, that's like the... Hmm. That's the moment that you're, you're playing this game for. And uh, hopefully we can experience another one of those moments in the Champions League final which is ahead of us. I think next episode is going to be an episode of finals. We have the FA Cup final. We have the end of the Premier League. And we have the Champions League final. That's all I think going to be played in the next episode. We might have the Carabao Cup final. I'm not sure if that's a thing. Do they do a final for that? But, yeah, we're going to play... Uh, a lot of finals in the next episode. So it's going to be an episode of finals. I think I'm going to call it that, in fact. I haven't even played it yet. I'm not even going to play it today. So I'm probably going to forget about that. Can we double up here? Can we find a way to double up? I'd love to. It would be spectacular, and we don't. I think this is going to be the last couple moments. Ref's going to blow his whistle right there. And it is one to one. We are through to the Champions League final. It was a tense match. Manchester United, our crosstown rivals, gave us a run for our money. It was absolutely beautiful. Vargas with a shot. The shot of the tournament. The goal of the tournament. Absolutely just, just killing it, man. Just absolutely killing it. Number one on the Sports Center top ten. Look at the beautiful stats. They're so great that it, the, the screen is just broken. Anyway, love you guys. Thank you so much for watching episode 29. It's 29 episodes. That's awesome. 
of the Obed Vargas career mode. We're playing for Manchester City and we're playing in a lot of big moments. Really pumped up. Thank you guys for being here. Subscribe, comment, like, subscribe again, like again, and then subscribe again and like again because you have to do it an odd number of times because every time you click it, click it once, you subscribe, you click it again, you unsubscribe. So make sure it's an odd number of times that you click it, but do it a bunch of times. You know, it's a lot of fun. Love you guys. Peace.